to day four of Vlogmas. So the decorations are starting to go up <laughs> slowly, but surely. Um, and I'm gonna go run a few errands today. I have a lot of work to do today, so I'll try to make today not too boring, and hopefully we'll have a fun dinner plan for you. So come along for the journey. Oop, every Christmas, I need a power strip. If I won't get a second one at 50% off, but there isn't a second one. Oh well. My pyramid blew out, so I need pyramid light. I usually get the clear ones, but here's my two. Oh, here's clear ones. Please buy one, get the second one and half off. But I don't need a second one. <laughs> what to do? What to do? It's Christmas. I bought some Christmas earrings. Just wanted to show you how pretty the tree looks out back. If the camera will focus on it. Well, it's not coming off as orange as it looks in person. But look at the leaves underneath. It looks like a, an orange shadow. <laughs> Digging through some old Christmas decorations. We got some of these pillows. Oh, my friend Cindy bought me this when we were teenagers. I still have it. <laughs> There's a mug. I'll probably fill that up with like red and green M&M's or something. <laughs> I bought this for my mom a long time ago. I think it's so cute. And this is a musical bell. A little Santa. Some snowmen. Some ladies having tea. <laughs> <laughs> I bought this guy last year, this little elf. Watch. Boing. <laughs> He's cute. And we have some snow and some beads. I used to put these around the tree, but now they've dwindled, so there's not enough to go around the tree, so I just kind of put them on the table. Some of these, these are all music boxes. Well, this is a music box. These light up. There used to be three, but the cat broke one of them. Hello, I'm sitting here and working on a blog post for this week. And it was inspired by a YouTube video that I watched. It was about 10 things to do before the end of the year. So I'm not really sure we all have time to do 10 things before the end of the year because it's already December 4th. <laughs> um, so I thought I would write a blog post where I I come up with 10 ideas and maybe you can pick two or three of them and try to do them by the end of the year um, to just make yourself happier um, or maybe to get into some Christmas spirit. They're not all Christmassy things, but um, I'll read some of the ideas to you because I haven't come up with all 10 yet um, and let me know what you think. So one of them, my first one that I wrote down was to say no to something. Um, in December we try to do everything and be everything to everyone and uh, we feel a responsibility to go to everyone's party and to do this and to do that and go shopping with this person and go shopping with that person um, but it's really important to have some time for yourself too so say no to something in December and use that time to do something that makes you happy so that's one of them I had another idea that was um, and I read this somewhere too and I can't remember so if I'm stealing someone's idea I, I apologize for that but it was to cook a meal for someone who's really busy you don't you know they don't have time to make dinner and just like leave it on their front step ring the bell and then run away <laughs> sort of just like you know a surprise dinner or just pop over in the afternoon and say I'm coming in this, I'm gonna stop by and say hi to you I don't have time to stay don't worry I'm not gonna take up too much of your time 
and then hand them like a casserole or something they can just heat up for that evening and you can really really relieve somebody's stress by just giving them a surprise dinner that's already home cooked for them I thought that was a cute idea and I, I apologize um, that I don't remember where I got it because it wasn't my original idea um, another thing was to do something crafty like make a homemade decoration for your tree or um, some cookies or a candle or something like try to find something crafty that you make with your own hands that can become a future Christmas heirloom that you'll treasure down the road and let me th see I had a, I have I have seven or eight things on here I want to try to come up with ten I want to give you another one um, find something free to do in your area there's probably a church somewhere that has a choir singing for the holidays or Maybe there's a tree lighting ceremony in a park or in a municipal building or something. There's all, I'm sure there are all kinds of free things going on for the holidays that you can do to just participate in some Christmas spirit without spending any money. Um, so I hope these give you some good ideas. And if you have any ideas of your own that you'd like to share, please write them below in the comments section. And uh, we'll see how this blog post turns out. <laughs>